my name is Stanley and I'm from RC Tank Legion. Thank you for watching my channel. So today we're going to do another unboxing video and this box is big. It's from the UK. Let's check it out what's inside. Okay, so we've got a bunch of Panzer IV uh, uh, shoots and skirts. So we've got about five. These are great. Let me see what's inside. That's good. Okay. Oh, very nice. These are, I think the turret mounts, I think. Okay. Nicely 3D printed. These are all FDM printed. Very nice and flat. Okay. Very high density print. And these are the brackets for the body and the turret as well. And a very clear instruction kit. Okay, so instruction kit for your Schutzen. Okay, so this is the Panzer IV Schutzen kit or side skirt armor. So this is the Tusk 2, oh, okay, we, we did the unboxing for the Tusk 2 uh, in the first video. So again, it comes with the color instructions, nice sandpaper from Germany. Okay, got all the little, little extra bits and pieces. Overall, an excellent kit, very solid. And all that, so the dragon skin tiles for the sides and all that bits and pieces. So you guys have seen this already, I'll skip to the next uh, item too, since we did the unboxing for the for that one already. Okay. Oh, very different. What are these? The SLA printed parts, very uh, very well packed. Uh, these are the side armors. Again, very nicely printed, very solid. Very minimal finishing needed. Okay, this would be the I think the turret armor or the back armor. This is the uh, commander's uh, armor station again. Yeah, more side armor plates. Again, all the white ones are FDM printed, and the, the, the gray ones are SLA resin printed. Oh, okay, this is for the, uh, this is the 50 MG, 50, uh, 50 cal uh, BMG. This is the, uh, the wire cutter. And I can't remember this one. Probably the front side armor. A roll, a very nice kit, very complete. Yes. Let's figure out what is this though. Okay, coming on to all the extra bits and pieces that uh, that armor models are so kind to send me. Anyways, this is the Challenger 2 turret kit. Uh, if you have the Chobham armor for the bottom, this is the, the top part, the top half. Uh, we've got, let me see, let me get to the uh, the bits that we bought. Okay, this is the Panther Schutzen. We have the, the late version, which is this one. And the early version, where are you? Early version, there we go. So this is the early version and we have the late version. The difference is the mounting hole. The early version is two hole, the late version is one hole. Okay, let me get it out of the way. And we have a nice, uh, yeah guys, don't get dirty thoughts. This is a Stoom Tiger uh, shell. It's actually a mortar rocket shell. See how big this is? It's great, even the, even the the rocket propellant the details are there and no finishing required look how smooth this is this is great I can't believe this is actually F FDM printed you know this looks like it's a SLA printed but it's not it's smooth as heck yeah ladies don't get excited no this is not battery operated okay we've got, uh, we've got okay let's see what's this one Got the Challenger Periscope 
Okay, this is the one that is mounted on the Challenger 2 um, turret, and this the, ba the the thing about this is that the periscope can be swiveled, and uh, there are the the trap the doors that open it. So SLA printed, it will swivel, and there are the doors over here that opens and close the armored doors that open and close the uh, for the for the optics. Okay, very nice kit. Okay, and one, two, let me put this away. Right, Penta Flight Skit, put this away. Okay, so I want to, I want to give a shout out to uh, Ahmed Models because he gave me all this free stuff, which is uh, the Stoom Taker Round. This is the Machine Gun MG34 42 uh, Ahmed cans, the um, ammo cans, sorry, Ahmed cans, ammo cans. These are SLA printed. Beautiful, you don't even need to do any finishing. Just wash it and uh, prime it and paint. Very nice. So you want to dress up your um, your figurines or your dioramas or your tanks. This is great. And over here we have the KV, uh, KV machine gun. Okay, and this is the assembled version over here. You can put this on your KV, I think turret or your front, I think the bow gun. The Henglong ver version, they just give you a little stick, whereas this is a nice detail with a swivel ball mount. Oh yeah, the swivels! Sweet! And then we got the shell. This is the T-34 resin shell. SLA printed. Need to touch up a little bit with the finishing, but otherwise, finely detailed. 76mm uh, shell comes with four shells in a crate very nicely detailed and we've got the last bit I don't know how you pronounce this in, in Russian SU-152 uh, shell let me see ooh it's huge this is a two-piece shell as you can see this is a big howitzer size shell uh, it's a two-piece ammunition, so it comes in uh, two pieces. Because I think I'm sure it's too big to be handled by by one man, so that's why they made it in two pieces. So this is great. Okay, you can get this from our web store rctanglegion.com. And until then, uh, please subscribe. No, until then, until. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's unboxing video. So until the next video, I hope you guys stay safe during this pandemic. Remember to wear masks, wash your hands and stay safe so please remember to like share and subscribe thank you for watching